back. So I just wanted to share this article. This is huge news. Um, the reason why it's big is there's been a pushback in crypto for the last two years. I've been seeing is the big banks, the big investment companies. They've all been saying Bitcoin's gonna should be banned. Ray Dalio said that Bitcoin could be banned by the government. There is a lot of pushback, and at the beginning, crypto was uh, an anti-bank asset. So they believed that they needed to crush crypto. They have now embraced crypto three years later. So you see all of the banks, JP Morgan saying you should put a, some of your asset allocation into crypto for retirement. You have Visa partnering with crypto card to settle dollar transfers on Ethereum. So I just wanted to share this article because it's changing it's a big change in the posture of big banks. So Visa's piloting a transaction settlement in stable coins on the Ethereum blockchain. The credit card provider that moves billions of dollars each day in 200 markets announced they'll accept their first settlement payments in US dollar coin, USDC, which is on the Ethereum blockchain. It's pegged to the US dollar at 1.1. It's gonna be with the global wallet partner, crypto.com on the Ethereum blockchain. So this would allow them to settle portions of its obligations for the crypto.com visa card program in usdc on the back end anchorage uh, digital asset bank will act as the custodian with the funds being sent so it's interesting that this article came out today because i already have Let's see if you can see that there's no numbers on the front so i already have a crypto.com uh, visa card where you can spend crypto uh, using your visa and I test it out it works it works in stores you can pull cash out so I'm not sure why this is big today when this card has been out for years but it's good it's good news and any news like this is good news so it looks like the card giants are already partnering with 35 digital currency platforms including coinbase crypto.com blockfi bitpanda so what you're going to see what you're going to see is a lot of companies and a lot of exchanges coming out with these types of cards and they're going to allow people to spend their crypto using these cards that was the biggest thing people would say is you can't eat your bitcoin you can't spend your bitcoin well most people don't want to because you'll end up like that guy who's bought you know a pizza for ten thousand bitcoins but if you do need the funds that is an easy way to cash out so i just wanted to share that with you and there's actually a link below this video if you want to get one of those credit cards um, if you join through my link it's an affiliate link and you deposit i think it's a hundred dollars you will get 25 dollars as a bonus so also there's different levels of the card so the cash back depends on the different levels that you're using you can get up to five or ten percent cash back on your cards on all of your purchases and it gets paid to you right away so i would go with that that's all i have for today